That was an absolutely delicious meal. The first time I had lobster actually, and I would say it tasted very, very good. Hi everyone, and welcome to our channel. We are Hannah and Johnny, also known as Finding Our Adventure. In 2020, we converted our Ford Transit to live in full time. Since then, we've been on an endless adventure with our two cats, Tia and Skye, exploring, living and working in our tiny home. Join us each week for a new episode of Finding Our Adventure. Good afternoon everybody and welcome to Cornwall. We have moved here, but more on that later. We've got the surfboard out and the wetsuits and we're gonna head down to the beach for a little surf session now. So the weekend just gone has been a very busy one for us. We have been enjoying Tunes in the Dunes, which is a festival featuring lots of different artists. Um, this year they had Kaiser Chiefs, James Bay, Freya Riding, uh, The Vaccines, and lots of other really, really good artists as well. Um, so yeah, we basically just spent the weekend going backwards and forwards from the van to listen to some really good music. They had lots of really good food as well. And it was just such an amazing place for a festival with, right on the beach and with views of the sea, which is very unique. And um, yeah, we also got to meet lots of locals, people that we knew online as well. We got to meet for the, for the first time, which was really nice. And yeah, it was just really good fun. All of the wildflowers are out at the moment. There's beautiful smells coming from everywhere and it's also lush and green at the moment and it just feel like it feels like everything's just come alive um, down here in Cornwall so it's just so pretty everywhere you look lots of different colours and nice smells so yeah it's just very nice to be here in Cornwall and we are very excited to be going down to the beach this afternoon. Good evening everybody. We kind of lost you last night after our surf session. We were pretty hungry so we went back to the van and had dinner and we are now walking back down to the town where we're staying um, to go try watch sunset. The weather so far since we've been here in Cornwall has been amazing. It's still only May but it's been warm, it's been sunny and it's just been really nice and we've just been enjoying our time just having a bit of a routine, a little bit of a base and we're really hoping we get a nice sunset tonight. So if you remember last year, we were here in Perrinporth as well and the rock pool behind me is where Hannah went swimming and that was a lot warmer weather because that was in the middle of summer so it's a little bit cooler today but it's still really nice and warm. The tide is going out at the moment so we're looking around all the rock formations and we're just having a really nice evening. I don't think there's going to be that great of a sunset because it's going behind clouds now but it's really calm today so it's really nice and peaceful. So it's been really nice watching the sunset. It's just about to dip behind some clouds so it might get a bit of nice colour but Yesterday it was like a very glowy sunset, so tonight's going to be more of a tame sunset. But it's so nice here, I think we're going to try and make it a bit of a habit to come and watch the sunset most nights. So we'll see how long we can keep that habit going for, but I think it will be a nice thing to look forward to at the end of the day. Good morning everybody. Since we've been down in Cornwall, we've really been enjoying um, setting a routine. So we've really been enjoying working out in the morning and then working on our website and doing some editing in the morning till about the afternoon time and then going for a walk or a surf in the afternoon. So this morning we're both going for a run together along the cliff tops, which is really beautiful. And then we're going to get back to the van, do some work, and then we'll probably go for an afternoon surf. We just finished our run 
And uh, the first bit's really nice along the cliff, and then we came through the town way and back up the hill, which is a really tough ending. And uh, yeah, really good run. Gonna head to the showers now, go get a shower, and then get on with some work. Good morning from a sunny Cornwall. We have been so lucky with the weather at the moment. We're just walking on our daily footpath that we use down to the town and down to the beach. And um, it's been really cool. Over the last couple of days, we've been watching the farmers cutting the grass and putting it into big um, hay bales. And they've all gone now. So the fields are just completely cut and the smell of cut grass is very nice. Those hay bales were only here yesterday. Yeah, they were only just here yesterday and they've taken them already. So yeah, they're all working very hard at the moment. I think probably because of the good weather. They're definitely making the most of it. And the smell of the freshly cut grass is amazing. Yeah. I just said that. Oh, you say that? <laughs> Sorry. Echo. <laughs> so yeah, we're heading down to the beach now and uh, we're just going to spend a nice chilled day out on the beach. We've been working pretty hard this week, but we have been squeezing in walks to the beach and surfs. So um, yeah, we're just going to take it easy today and we're potentially planning a barbecue later as well. So we've got lots to look forward to today and we are going to take you along for the ride. So this is our local walk down to the village into the beach and it takes about 20 minutes it's just under two kilometers and it's a really nice walk so we've been getting all our steps in each day and it's nice to be out in the sun and get the fresh air and it's just been really relaxing so far and it's been really good during the day when we've been getting all our work done for our website because we've got so many guides and articles that we need to write and so it's been really good after that to be able to get out and stretch our legs We've just got back from the beach and we've got the barbecue set up. We went and picked up all of our barbecue essentials earlier and we've got the coals ready. We're about to light them and Hannah's put the chicken on. It's all marinating, so it's going to be absolutely delicious. So far, we've got some chicken and burgers on the barbecue. We've also got sausages to come and plenty more chicken, actually. And it's just the perfect weather for a beautiful barbecue. I think there's nothing better than barbecue chicken. It's got like the nice like grilled bits and it tastes really good. We have had such a nice afternoon and really enjoyed our barbecue and now we're heading back down to the beach um, to go watch sunset because we think it's going to be a really nice sunset this evening and also do some photos. Um, so yeah, it's just a nice 20 minute walk back down to the beach again. We've really enjoyed doing this walk every day. It's going to make us really fit though because walking up and down this hill is, is a bit of good exercise. So we have just made it down to the beach and it looks like we're going to get a cracking sunset hopefully and it's starting to go golden, we've got people are enjoying themselves, it's a Saturday night so a lot of people are coming to enjoy the sunset as well, past some people eating fish and chips which smell really good and yeah it's just a really nice evening. Good morning everybody, it is another beautiful morning here in Cornwall and we've decided today we're going to long, walk along the coastal path to St Agnes. So um, we're going to enjoy the sun and I think we may even stop for a pasty along the way. t-shirt weather. Johnny's just taken his jumper off and we have made it to St Agnes which is where we were heading for um, and now we are gonna try and find maybe a pasty or something to fuel us for the journey back. We've treated ourselves to a little bit of food <laughs> and I've got the halloumi fish and chips and Johnny has got BLT and chips. We have just got back to the van. Our walk in the end was 14 kilometers, so a nice big one today. 
and I think we're both pretty tired now so I think we're just going to chill out here and maybe watch a movie later and we'll probably see you guys tomorrow. Good evening everybody, we have made it down to Watergate Bay and we have a reservation here tonight at the Beach Hut for dinner which is part of the Watergate Bay Hotel which is one of our favourite hotels in the whole world and the beach here is beautiful, we've got an amazing sunset, it's been so warm all day and if you remember, if you've been following us for a while you would have seen last year that we stayed in Watergate Bay and we'll link that up somewhere above so you can see that but we're going to head on down now and get ready for our dinner. So we've just walked up from the car park and the waves look really good today. They're like perfect beginner waves so I think we're going to have to come back for another day and surf here because we did a lesson last time we were here um, staying at the hotel but since then, that was like our first lesson, since then I think we've, we've come a long way. <laughs> well you have, I haven't. <laughs> We have made it to the beach hut and we've just ordered ourselves some drinks and olives to start and for the main, because it's Friday, it's we've gone for lobster and that's their like speciality they do every Friday so we're going to try that out. So our main has arrived, we've got lobster for our main and we've got chips and we've also got some sauces on the side and we are watching the sunset. That was an absolutely delicious meal. The first time I had lobster actually, and I would say it tasted very, very good. We had a beautiful sunset, and now we are going to be heading back to where we're parking for the night, and maybe do a quick food drop on the way. We've just walked along the cliff to watch a beautiful sunset, and I just wanted to apologize because of the bitterness of this video. And the reason it's been a little bit bitty is because we've been getting settled in Cornwall. As we said at the beginning of this episode, we have actually moved here, and Part of the reason for moving here is because we are looking at doing some other things over the next few years and we wanted to spend our last summer potentially in the UK living in one of our place, favourite places which is Cornwall and also because van life in the UK is pretty challenging. So you might be wondering where have we moved to <laughs> other than obviously we've mentioned Cornwall but we are actually basing ourselves on a campsite um, because we decided that it would make a bit more sense to have a bit more of a base somewhere that we can kind of come to and from still do a bit of traveling but also um, just not have to stress about finding park ups and just having a bit more of a place that we can settle into so that's been really nice we've been making the most of hot showers and um, yeah met some really lovely people on the campsite and just enjoying getting out in nature like once we finish work in the day we might go for a nice walk go for a swim do some surfing and it's um, just been the perfect decision for us at the moment. One of the things we do want to do over the next year or so is buy some land and we do have an apartment we're trying to sell. We have tenants in there at the moment so as soon as that's sold we can really push forward with buying some land. We have a few places in mind that we've been looking at but yeah that's the next big project on our list. So since we've moved to Cornwall the weather has been absolutely amazing. It feels like summer is already here and we're really grateful to have um, decided to come at this time because earlier on we were in Europe so I think we've planned it quite well even though a lot of people are going to Europe now we've decided we're going to stay in the UK for summer make the best of the weather here now and um, and it has been epic so far like yeah. all the way through May it's been warm and hot and sunny yeah we haven't had any rain no it's yet, been dry as so anything we've obviously got a lucky charm being here <laughs> and uh, we've got a few other trips planned over summer so stay tuned for those adventures and if you want to see what we get up to over the summer don't forget to subscribe and let us know in the comments what your favorite part of this video was and give us a thumbs up too and we will see you in the next one see ya